Hello everyone, Jet here, and welcome back to my Skaven playthrough. Right, over now, um, we're going to be jumping straight into the Battle of Hag Hall here. I've decided I can't afford to wait, because it's, it's had such an income of my economy. So this, this is not going to be an easy battle. So we're throwing a few extra um, menace from belows out. Um, and we're going to be burning off all our food after this. So this is potentially not going to be leaving us in a good position. But I just feel I need to, I need to recapture here, and I need to recapture it fast, guys, because um, basically I'm losing too much by not having here held. Um, I'm losing far, far too much. Um, Oh, I wonder if they've had a chance to re-repair... Uh, gates automatically repair, thinking about it, don't they? So... Um, and it now looks completely different! Right, so this is straight out. We are, I'm happy with that amount of magic. So we're going to straight into deployment. Right, now I don't want to rush this. Um... Because we've got other people, and I'll throw my Skaven slaves onto the wall first, which are with the other army. This is my ranged units. They can sneak forwards. Um, hmm. This is where the whole thing gets tricky, because do I want to charge early? Obviously, my Doom Wheel is going to be a bit pointless here. All of these guys can get themselves forwards. We're going to smash that gate first. You guys can all charge forwards. You guys can get into range of these guys. And you guys can start sneaking forwards as well because we can get some good shots off. Okay, we're smashing that gate nice and fast. Uh, what do they have behind that gate? Nothing. In fact, they don't have many spears as well, so we'll be getting my uh, catapult through there quickly. Um, hmm. and you guys can charge straight up onto the wall. My storm vermin can uh, hit their main chunk of wall. In fact, no. These guys. Oh. No. My Storm Vermin aren't going to. Everything else. You guys are going to hit the walls. You guys are going to form up in here. My Storm Vermin are going to charge this gap. Because if my Storm Vermin can get through, that's really going to help us out. Uh, you can charge through here. Let's chuck you guys on there. Let's have some fun. In fact, let's uh, drop a lightning there. They're pretty much perfectly positioned for me to do that. You guys can get a little buff. We're suffering a little bit with my frame rate here. Sorry about that, guys. Um, you guys can reform here. Yeah, there's no point in me doing that. Never mind. Okay, we threw that gate on mass. Actually, that's really nice. Right, they are really dug in here. Let's drop another lightning on them there. We're going to hit some of my own. We're going to hit far more elves there. That was a huge hit. Right, so all of these guys are here now. We're actually just going to hammer through here and get behind them. You guys can all actually start charging back up here. 
onto the walls from the other side to take finish them off. Where's Tretch? Tretch to stay here. My assassin can go get on there, Lord. Oh, and here we go again. Again, we're going to hit some on my own, but we're going to cause far, far more damage to them. Let's drop you there. Ooh, turn around, get on them. No, you guys can get on them. Let's get this guy out of there. He's getting completely pounded. They're doing their job. Guess what we're doing? I do love this spell because it does so much damage. Some of you guys can just charge up. You guys can move over here, because if they land on you, get some spears over there, actually. They're breaking. We're breaking them on the walls now. And this is a mass route. And actually, guys, we've done far better than I expected there. My assassin took a lot of damage, but actually that battle went really, really nicely. Um, I'm impressed by my Skaven there. We, But we knocked the wall around. We, we flanked. We got around them. We got behind them. And this guy, just that warp lightning. I love warp lightning, guys. It is one of the most fantastic spells, especially in situations like that where they were perfectly, they they were perfectly clumped for me to hit. Yes, yes. Right, this is where we're gonna suffer for a bit because I'm uh, burning all of this you are to uh, get this settlement back to full. No, straight damage to start with. Right. We want that one straight away. I want that one straight away. What else do I want? And the wall straight away. Uh, that's going to give me a nice big buff there. Uh, let's see. That's painful, but we'll start regenerating that quite quickly, I hope. You guys can have your Skaven slaves burnt up. No, in fact, you guys are instantly going to head north to uh, make sure this set area stays friend stays happy. Pick up this island. So actually all of this place is good as well. So we could go this way and we can go to the north as well. Let's go have a look in the north. So I, I do have options. It's just they're not always necessarily the best of options. Um, don't really need the bonus versus large. I don't really need the Doom Engineer just now. Let's get the public order and untainted for now. No, let's take the growth. Okay. That does tell me I really need to expand, guys, because that is my issue at the moment, is I'm too small. I'm surrounded by people I can't really afford to go to war with. Um, it, it's, it's just a really tricky position, actually, here. Because uh, I, I, I could do some trade. I could do with getting out of where I currently am. Oh, wow. Why are they all just wondering, well, Marathi is getting her butt kicked. That's why they're just wandering through Marathi's territory. Um, so I need to get in a position to be able to take advantage of that if I can, which I kind of have done already. Um, 
but it does unfortunately look like I'm likely to become the bastion against the elves and the uh, uh, the elves and Mazamundi, which isn't necessarily the position I want to be in. Right. Let's get a bell. I'm just whacking everything out here to start with, guys. This isn't about getting the right thing. Ambush, 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 ambush. Come on, get that ambush proc. Mm. They are not going to be nice. I'm going to go straight into this, guys. Um, simply because I get Vanguard deployment anyway. So, the losing that, um, losing that ambush, it's still a pain. I'm not looking forward to fighting this. Um, they've got the units which enrage here, and they are going to be hard to deal with. This isn't the best army, it, it's, but it's going to be a tough little nut to crack. Um, it's got some very strong, powerful units in it. They've got these flyers, which are going to be a pain. Um, but I should be able to blitz them. Then we can fall back here into ambush stance to keep anybody out. So we are definitely taking a gamble there. That's actually perfect. We're going to jump in on this side straight out. Storm Ready. You guys can take the brunt, while my other guys flank. Oops. You guys can go here with the assassin. Tretch can actually stay up here for now. them. Let's get my storm vermin in, in on them. Let's get Tretch in on them as well. Ah, this is where I could have used the truck, the Rictus clan stone. They're doing their job nicely. They can keep hitting those skinks. You can go in there. We're going to fold straight into the back of them here. Where's their lord? My assassin's going straight for that lord. You're going straight on there. Buff up. My lord. Pop that straight through all of their units there. Just hammer into the side of them there. So just give them a little bit more leadership. Pin them. Let's drop that straight on my temple guard. Get my assassin out. Get out, get out, get out. He's just used a smoke bomb to get out. So you guys can all hit him. You can get out. This has gone nicely. Oh, you guys get yourselves in. Oh, well, why are you guys stopping? Let's 
You can go there to pin. You guys can move around here actually to flank. These guys don't do nice things to my Skaven, as you can see. <laughs> Again, I don't do nice things to my Skaven either, as you can see. And we've smashed them. That went better than I expected, actually, guys. That was a nice, solid victory again from us there. My assassin is taking too much damage. I'm using him wrongly, aren't I? I'm uh, getting him involved in the fights when he should be uh, picking his targets a bit more. My uh, Doom Wheel is now completely elite. Um, we didn't get a huge amount of kills there, but this was a small, you know, this was quite a small army, so Another actually victory. we did very yes, nicely yes. there. More slaves, good, good. Answer to me. Okay. Morafi will hear your insignificant plight. Your time with me is precious, oh, so make no your me. request. Malachus. They're really good friends with me. They just don't want to trade with me at all. Could do with meeting half Garland properly. Um... You can start heading up that way. Right. Straight down your weapon strength tree there. We can pull back a bit now. We'll kick them out of our territory. What do I want this last one? Yes, yes. Victory for Tretch. We've got that elsewhere. I guess we're going to leave that one for now. For now, in fact, I can swap all of these out as well now because I don't need to worry about uh, this territory is at full. So I can swap these out for other things as well, but I'm not going to be doing that just yet. Hmm. Again, up here I want to save for other things. Okay, so that's our, our current crisis dealt with. We are gaining food again now, nicely, for a few turns. That will go up as we level up again. Um, so that's not something I'm massively worried about. Um, I need to look at getting myself out or working out how best to assist Marathi. Now Marathi's lost her capital so she's actually going to be having public order issues as well now from the chaos corruption she spreads. So that's a, a, a thing she's really going to have to be struggling with actually. Um, does make it interesting certainly but that said I'm in a sa I'm in a safe position well I'm not I'm in a safe ish position at the moment I've pushed out the invasions they're still mostly focusing on Marathi I've got my sneaky sneaky ways of dealing with things I'm still very tempted to go and take here try and take it to them a little bit okay 10% extra movement range from that technology that is very good for us um, up my public order. Let's actually give the extra armor for clan rats. That'll be oh, we've got devious plans as well now. So let's start doing that one. That'll be very nice. Um, Stick to mm, we'll swap that out for a bell. Get him the extra armor, and you are definitely getting some defensive buffs, actually. 
Um, I say that, I am can keep upping his damage for now. Chieftain of the Deep Warrens. <laughs> Into Nest Barrow. Hmm. Great Warlord. Clan will rise, rise. Burn off those Skaven slaves. Gets us a little bit more income. To get this mysterious island. Can't see revenge, but it's, it's, it's still worth having. I just was not expecting the elves to evade me through there at that point in time. Um, I was expecting them to uh, be busy dealing with Marathi, and as I said, Marathi seems to be suffering. Which I suspect means Marathi is going to uh, to uh, confederate with uh, Nagaron sooner rather than later, um, which will be good because it will mean I'll start losing this chaos corruption which is spreading into my lands. Um, that said, I, I I really should have taken all this territory over here when I got the chance because that would have really helped my income, um, but I just didn't jump at it when I got the chance to. If I can get trading with Malekith, that is going to massively help us. Warpstone. We hate, hate water. Who seeks the counsel of the Witch King? No! Come on, yes. you know you want to trade with me. And it's infuriating now because she's still got this territory, which means I can't get through here now. Mighty am I, Can I? I? No. I not wait to scat. Hmm. I want to start leveling this one up. That'll give me a nice. But we already got a nice buff to my income from here. And I want to get those two, but they're expensive, and that's the issue. Yep, yeah, let's get fight dirty, upping night runners. Um, speed for infantry units will be very nice as well. Um, upkeep for night runners and gutter runners will help. Ambush success charts. I want to go straight for that. Um, That's also very nice. Okay, let's end turn. So if I can get some trade agreements off, actually, I will start doing much, much better. Because uh, you saw how much I'd get from some of those trade agreements, and that would really help me get out. It's just infuriating that Marathi and, and, Nag and Malakif won't trade with me. Um, especially as they're confederated with the people, or squash, the people who were trading with me. Um, which really isn't ideal. Hmm. Okay, it's nearly background to us, guys. Um, as I think I'm okay for the moment. I think that was just unlucky with all of that coming through into my territory at the same time. Um... Not a huge buff to my income getting that up. That's the problem. Where's this one? Vol's Anvil. It's 80, but we do get the extra 60%.
both these, oh, I'll only get 40 from these, that's the downside of these. That said, you know, they are going to also provide me with other things. Uh, our income is now positive again, this needs levelling up, that's important. Hmm... Skull Reef! That I want. Aha! Uh -huh. What has driven the Skaven from their dark lairs? Ill considered. Why not? Short sighted. But no, so we're going to meet a few more people up there as we, as we explore and hopefully we'll be able to get a trade partner or two out of it which will help us along the way um, and then we'll be able to work out exactly where we're going to push. As uh, I should have taken this, this little chunk of territory when I had the chance and I, I missed a trick doing that. Um, I wasn't very scaven, I should have taken it when I could. Um, Right now I am just surrounded by huge powers, which is going to make this very, very difficult. It does almost make me, I'm, I'm half tempted to sail over to the old world and start start pushing into the empire almost. Um, the council's voice. Please share your inanities with me. Never! It is going up though. Let the bell scream, scream. So we are meeting more factions now as we're expanding. There you go. What Can we just sweep them the now? Skaven from their dark short sight. These guys are we are going up with these guys, so hopefully we'll get something soon. Alright. Morassi! I find myself deeply intrigued by you. Can we buy you off? Weakling! See, this worries me. The fact Speak that I'm slowly deteriorating with these guys. I accept. Speak. Oh, the Skaven. How delightful. I think not. Yeah. Pan needs new battle boots. Right. First thing first before I do anything else. Get both of those going. Now we can look. What else do we want here? Time to do it, leaders. That's going to also help our income a bit. And we are going to be ending this one here, guys. Once again, as always, guys, I really do hope that you've enjoyed that. So uh, thank you very much for watching. Please feel free to, uh, well, please take the time to look at some of my other playthroughs, guys. Because I know a lot of people are just watching this one at the moment. I've got, an, uh, I've got Tomb Kings as well as various other ones going on as well, guys. So uh, please feel free to do that. And as always, thank you very much for watching.